hello everyone welcome to africa note food i hope everybody is well we are doing well as well i hope you have washed your hands today so we have washed our hands now today we're going to make meatball with pasta yeah so we have our meat our meat minced beef here yeah yeah then we're going to leave it in this bowl here and then we have our salt parsley uh cayenne pepper and black pepper oregano and here we have uh, diced onion and garlic that we're going to use with and here we have our breadcrumb here that we're going to use this whole meat so we're going to put everything in there for you guys to see so first we are going to add our breadcrumb okay. mm -hmm. and then we're going to add the the onion and the garlic so i have two cloves of garlic and i have one medium sized onion here and i'm going to add that and the parsley i have two tables i have two teaspoons of parsley here you can have you can use fresh one if you have i don't have it so i'm using dry one and then the salt i have one teaspoon of uh, salt and the cayenne pepper one tablespoon and half a tea, uh, table, uh, teaspoon of black pepper and uh, half as well of uh, uh, oregano here so I'm going to mix them together yeah make sure you mix it really well yeah, yeah. so now we have finished doing our mix and mash now we're going to mold it into small pieces like that so yeah. do it the way you think is best for you but this is how i do it yeah. Don't make it too big make it small so you cook easily and quick and so the meat if you don't have uh, uh, beef you can use lamb yeah this lamb means lamb also you can do that with or any means of your choice if you're in chicken or whatever you can do that as well I see you on lockdown now. We are home, we're not doing much. So we have to make ourselves occupied doing things, reading, cleaning, and all that. Not much to do, can't go out. Yeah. So that's some meatballs. So I'm going to finish the whole thing. And I'll so show this you. This is it. Uh, we finish our bowls. Now we're going to separate them into two. Cook one and put the rest in the freezer. So I have added a bit of olive oil in my uh, oven pan here. Yeah. So I'm going to add the meatballs in there and put it in the oven for at least 15 minutes, 10 to 15 minutes. And then we're going to make our stew also. Not really stew, saute onions and add the meat into it. Yeah, so while our meatballs are on the, in the oven, we're going to cook our onion. So I'm going to add this much of olive oil. And add my onions so I have that much onions so I have about three big size onions here so I'm going to leave it to cook for about five minutes so this is our meatballs out of the oven 
you see all this juice that is in there I'm going to use this for my sauce mm -hmm. now my onion has been cooked for five minutes so I'm going to add some mushroom in there tin mushroom you all know there's no fresh ones you can't get any fresh ones so I'm using the tin one in there and it smells good very very good and also thyme garlic powder black pepper mm -hmm. mix them together so. I'm going to add my meatballs and the uh, the onions so yeah I have added the meat now I'm going to add the juice also here in there you don't throw anything away look all right in there see let's see Oh, it smells beautiful. Very nice. And I'm going to add a bit of water into it also and leave it to cook. So, this is how much water is going in there about half, half a cup of water in there. And also, I'm going to add. flour the flour is for the sauce to thicken up okay so I have about one tablespoon of flour here okay. and then I'm going to mix this And I'm going to cover it after to cook for about 10 minutes and it will be done. But this is it. Our meatball and onion saute mushrooms is done. Look at that. Look at this. And it tastes good. It smells nice. So I'm going to serve this with my pasta that I make earlier. So this is it. This is our meatball with the pasta, I have added a bit of broccoli, steamed uh, broccoli on the side. We're going to have this for lunch. So thank you for coming today. I hope this will help you and we'll see you soon. Please be safe, wash your hands and love you all. See you soon. Bye.